Yeah. Well, the thing is, what about, isn't, like, Adventure Time and all those, like, Cartoon Network shows, like, a uh, regular show, aren't those kind of, like, the same forms of comedy? Shut the hell up. Regular show is a masterpiece. <laughs> yeah, yeah! Fizz <laughs> Give me some sugar! You're fired! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. I think this is why. <laughs> I think this is why. <laughs> okay, Quinn. What's something that's popular now that annoys you? All right. This is... <laughs> This is kind of where I was going with this question, right? Um, <laughs> enthusiast grade coloring books. <laughs> like the adult ones where there's swears and whatnot? No, 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 no. Apparently, there's been this rise of coloring books, like this resurgence of, like, okay, we need coloring books in whatever. Because uh, basically, I went to Costco yesterday and they have an entire section for enthusiast grade coloring books they have more coloring books for adults than for children in their like coloring books what what's the difference so children's coloring books you're coloring like elsa and like frozen people right Mm -hmm. but in the enthusiast grade it's basically like Someone drew a really good image of a tiger and you color it in. Or like someone doodled a bunch of stuff in black and white and you get to color it in. Why is this annoying you? <laughs> because it's like, what, why is it becoming popular? Like its popularity I, is, it? is annoying me. I've never seen someone coloring in one. That's of because it's it's just hitting the market, Nick. It's just getting big. Let me tell you. I think you're making it popular. By in the next about year, it. consumer enthusiast grade <laughs> coloring books will be on every shelf of every bookstore. I mean, they probably already are, but they'll be there I in masses. If... I swear it. I kind of wish Mandy was here for this one because I think she would stand up for him. <laughs> I think she would be into him. She'd be like, she would. What do you was... got it? <laughs> Well, you got against the thing. They had drawn. specific like, they had a uh, Harry Potter themed right. enthusiast yeah. grade coloring books. They had like wow. um, Alice in Wonderland, but like like more yeah. abstract e stuff. Yeah, I think this is like Mandy's market. Exactly, <laughs> and it's pissed me off. <laughs> like there was one who was just like, okay, this this book is basically a picture book that's in black and white so you can read through it and ins- experience the story as well as color it and it's like what like who cares right like you could do that with any book and then there's you like know this who else this... doesn't care my mom <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> you're fine what's wrong with you too <laughs> <laughs> And the, the worst thing was there was this, so they had all these like themed adult coloring books. Like none of them are adult as in the sense of like adult videos, but it's just like weird how they're labeled like adult or enthusiast grade. And then the last one was like, I actually took a picture of it on my phone. Hold on. Let me get my phone and see what it said. It was pretty bizarre. Hold on. He's going to, okay, everybody, he's going to describe it to us. <laughs> this is going to work out. It's going to be magical. <laughs> this phone's not going to work. <laughs> His roommate butt dialed him. He's gonna start talking to his roommate. <laughs> no. And his roommate's gonna be like, "Yo, dog, I'm going to a hockey tournament. You wanna come?" And Quinn's like, "I love." That's personal tacklers. information, Nick. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. It's an extreme coloring and search challenge book for enthusiast grade. Uh, Enthusiast grade colorers. And what colorers? this is. How do they spell that? I have no idea. Uh, the thing is <laughs> that they have. It, so it's not only a, like, find the hidden objects book, it's like an extreme coloring experience. Mm. And it upsets me. Mm. It upsets me a lot. Because basically, it's. 
like they either have like the front of this book is a really detailed tiger head hmm. surrounded by little doodles that are like really shitty like i could do these <laughs> so i don't understand like what is this it's just something there the, uh, there's like a therapy behind it's like therapeutic maybe uh, you think you're supposed to just doodle with it i think you'll think it, like this is supposed to help people like be more relaxed and it's like stressing you it out. can't it can't help people if it's worth 39 dollars <laughs> what whoa what the hell that is expense that is extortion I'm telling you and that, telling you sweeping that's the nation. like 28 pounds over in england <laughs> i did the conversion for you jazz 28 pounds <laughs> of tea <laughs> of indian grade tea they don't have pounds over there they do the metric yeah, it's Everybody actually not thirty nine dollars. It was only nine bucks, but I wish it was thirty nine dollars, so my point would be better. What? How much was it? It was only nine dollars. Still, that's, that's expensive. expensive. No, it's not you that could bad. Print them off the internet. <laughs> How uh, many pages is in this thing? Uh, it was probably like, probably like thirty pages of oh. coloring book stuff. I mean, the what thing ass? is, like, I'm impressed because they are pretty high quality and they do have, like, r- interesting images for you to color. But it's like, one. why is this popular? Well, I guess it's popular because it's interesting. I don't know. I Basically, what I did, I was like, I, I texted this guy who I don't really know that well. <laughs> Jojo. But I'm filming him for, <laughs> uh, he's making a mural, right? So I'm filming him make this mural. And I basically like texted him. I'm like, hey, you should just collect all your doodles, turn them to black and white, put it in a book, and sell it for ten bucks, and you'd be rich. Like, what was his response? What was his response? He said he called me a genius. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh well, there you go. Yeah, still noise. 